All right, y'all. Uh, now that I have described how a basic solar system works and how a solar system with batteries work and then in a difference in two, well, maybe three different scenarios in the last video, I want to hit on a part of the survey that has sort of got me, a, a word, I mean, thinking why people say what they said. They, they said that, well, the survey says 43.8% said that the cost of solar outweighs the benefits monetarily uh, so let me hit on that I've got a situation where there's a, a guy here in Omaha that he, he has a solar system that covers 100 percent of his energy use for the past uh, as, as, uh, as stated well well it covers 100 percent of his use usage considering his last past month last 12 months, so you know, for those who have solar system, we have to have your last 12 months so we can determine how much energy you need or how big your solar system is going to be to cover your bill. Uh, but his system also has batteries that cover his entire house. He uses about 31 to 35 kilowatt hours per day. So that means he, he needed four batteries. Those, fat, those batteries cost about $20,000 each. Uh, so, let me tell you why in this situation, it, right now it seems like it wouldn't, wouldn't benefit him. As a matter of fact, he probably won't be saving any month, money month to month until maybe five years from now. Uh, let me tell you why. He has those batteries. He, that just, that he doesn't really need it. Here in Omaha, all right, we really don't have a lot of power outages, so there's not really a need for batteries unless you just want it. Uh, you want to help the environment out, environment out and get those batteries, that's fine. We, we appreciate that. That's part of what clean renewable energy is about, saving the environment. However, he's, he doesn't really need it. Instead of buying those four batteries, what he could have done right, is maybe, well, let me tell you his situation right now. Uh, his, his bill is about 30 something dollars a month because uh, he doesn't, uh, it's, it, his system is covering almost, I mean, it is covering all of his bill. And all he has on his bill is his service charges, which we can't do anything about. We can only do something about the power usage. All right. Uh, but he could have gotten the same situ gotten the same results that $30 a month if he had just added just a couple more panels without batteries. Those panels could create excess energy and eliminating the kilowatt hours, kilowatt hours during the that he uses during the nighttime. He could have gotten the same results, but instead he, he bought four batteries, and those four batteries are powering his house at night. Didn't really need that. I don't even know why the agent who he saw didn't explain that to him. As a matter of fact, his current bill before his, with those four batteries, like a, a, a little above twice as much as he would be paying if he was just on the grid for right now. Of course, uh, for five, six, seven years from now, he'd be paying a whole lot more than what he's paying now if he was just uh, on the grid still. But in his, his scenario, he monetarily, he's not saving any money. As a matter of fact, he's spending more. That's because he has batteries that he don't that he doesn't really need. Now, if you're wealthy and you want to do that, you just want to help the environment. Fine, we can do that. We'll help you out. And we appreciate you trying to help the environment. But that's those batteries. If you your where you live don't have a lot of power outages, it's not really necessary. You can still save money if that's your goal to save money. If you're trying to save the environment, it, fine. Billy? You can do that. But in his situation, he doesn't really need those batteries. He could have added just a couple of more panels, create some extra credits to help eliminate his bill, and he, he'd have got the same results. Just that simple. But because he has those batteries, it appears that he's not, the benefits outweighs, the cost outweighs the benefits. So he won't be saving any money for at least, at least the next five years. But six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty, fifty years from now, oh, he'd be, oh, if he was still on the grid, 
uh, using dirty energy, he'd be paying a whole lot more. So.